Oh my gosh. I know a lot of people pre-cleanse their hair with like a pre-poo, but body? Don't get a TikTok account. Don't scroll TikTok because you will be buying everything. Everything. Y'all are gonna flip, flip when I tell y'all about this one product that I've been loving more than my Olay body conditioner. Hey y'all, I hope this doesn't fall. I really hope you guys don't fall, but we are in my bathroom today because I want to talk about hygiene products. I'm fresh out of the shower. I didn't feel like putting on any clothes, <laughs> but I want to talk about the products I have been loving that I use in the shower and out of the shower. I recently started using a few new products, like new to me. They're probably old, but like, They've probably been out for a while, but I just now started using them. Um, and I just wanna sit here, chill with you guys and just talk about these products. I started using this Dove um, Moisture Boost Pre-Cleansed Shower Butter. Now, this was really interesting to me because it's not often that I hear about people pre-cleansing their body. I know a lot of people pre-cleanse their hair with like a pre-poo, but body? It was interesting. I saw it in Target. Oh, I did a shop with me. If you guys wanna watch that, I'll have it linked in the description, but I'm actually gonna be going over some of the products that I shared in that shop with me video, but this is one of them. And I thought it was really interesting, so I just wanted to try it out. And I will say, I like it. Now, I won't necessarily say get this because it's a need, because I don't know. You don't really necessarily need to pre-cleanse your body, but for the um, the luxury and just, I don't know, the experience, because I know a lot of us like to just use a lot of products in the shower and just have a nice self-care moment, but it was nice, you know? It's very hydrating on the body. It's kind of like putting on the body conditioner, but you use it first before you go in with your, um, with your cleanser, but it's nice, it smells good. It's something I probably won't repurchase, but I do like the experience of using this. So yeah, the Dove Moisture Boost Pre-Cleanse Shower Butter. So once I rinse it off before I go in with my body wash, I notice that my skin is kind of, um, I don't wanna say oily, but it feels really soft and it has like a nice slip, that's the word. So it's nice and, my skin just has a nice slip to it, if that makes sense. But yeah, really been enjoying that. And I definitely wanted to just um, update you guys on the product since you guys saw me buy this when I was in Target um, a few weeks ago. So now let's get into the body wash. Before I talk about the body wash, I wanna talk about this. Okay, it's still dripping wet because I literally just got out of the shower. But this bath cloth is from Kitsch. I'll show y'all the name. Well, I'm gonna have it in the description, but this is the brand, Kitsch. Kish, Kitsch, I guess that's how you say it. But y'all, it has like a hidden pocket and you can kind of see my soap is still in there. But it has a hidden pocket in here for your bar soap. So if you don't wanna put your bar soap on the soap holder in the shower or in your tub, you can have it in this and hang it up. How cool is that? But yeah, I really like this um, washcloth because it's, you know, it's just a nice big washcloth that makes all of my body washes lather up really good. And I like the fact that it has a pocket for the soap. So that way I don't have to keep taking out the soap, putting it on the bar in the shower and stuff like that. But yes, girl. And then this is the little, um, you know, loop that you can hang it up in your shower. Let's talk about the body wash that I've been loving. It's the green clay and eucalyptus body wash. This is something I would say try out if you don't wanna spend the money on um, the Necessaire body wash. I wouldn't say it smells just like Necessaire, but it does have that eucalyptus scent that kind of gives your your um, your bathroom that spa-like feel because it definitely smells up the bathroom. It smells literally like a spa, but it doesn't smell exactly like the one from Necessaire, but as far as how it works on the body, this does leave my skin feeling, um, it doesn't leave my skin feeling stripped when I get out of the shower. So that's what I like. And when it comes down to a body wash and it has essential oils in it. So really, really, really good. And I'm almost out y'all. Mm, probably about right here is where the product is. It's kind of like shaking up a little, yeah. So 
right there almost out and i have been loving it now y'all i have been trying out this new body wash it's a new um brand at target it's called being frenchy i think that's how you say it but it's the soothe and comfort cashmere vanilla body wash oh my gosh y'all this this is this this is it this is for one affordable it smells incredible and it lathers up so 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 good so it has oat extract and niacinamide in it which i know a lot of us love the niacinamide in a lot of our products so um yeah highly recommend this body wash if you're looking for something that smells incredible that's gonna smell up the entire bathroom that's gonna lather really good and that's not gonna dry out your skin i will say if you tried the body by tbh body wash the vanilla one I think that one's also vanilla. I have it, it's in that cabinet over there. I don't wanna get up. Actually, let me get up. Okay, no, it's the vanilla tube rose. This one right here. So this one, it's a little stronger than this one right here. This one is very soft, it's sweeter, and it just, mm, it smells delicious so definitely wanted to tell you guys about that they have so many other products i have another product from the brand that i'm going to talk about towards the end of the video um but yeah been loving that body wash and then okay so the soap that i've been loving as well is this um well the bar soap this is the dove pink bar soap that i always put in my um washcloth that i just showed you this is the soap right here which i need to put another one in there because that other one is about to be gone okay the body scrubs i've been using is this tree hut is the tree hut strawberry body scrub i'm not new to tree hut scrubs but this scent is pretty new to me and i actually really really like it i was reading some reviews um a lot of people were saying they're not really the biggest fan of the strawberry one but i actually like it like it smells really it smells like a strawberry starburst to me maybe not to some people but to me it just it it smells good so yeah this is just the one that i have been using um the most lately and that i've been loving and then i have a foot scrub that i want to tell you guys about it's the earth therapeutics refreshing foot scrub the scent is not the best well i am not a fan of the scent maybe you guys will like it it has wild mint tea tree oil and wintergreen but it's called the Earth Therapeutics Refreshing Foot Scrub. This stuff works wonders, wonders on the feet. And the way I use it is taking this, which is also from Kish. I love their stuff, y'all. Um, but yes, yeah, from Kish. And this is a exfoliating glove. So I just squirt a little bit on here. And I know it's like a lot of exfoliating going on right here because it's like scrub and then exfoliating scrub but it works it works for me and i love it so i just take it squirt it on here and then scrub my feet with it and my feet are baby bottom smooth like they are so 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 smooth now this is also um you can also use this on your body if you want to just you know exfoliate your body with it or on your face because i read that this is also good to exfoliate your skin because it does it's really rough like really really rough I wouldn't use it on my face because how rough it is but when I say this is the perfect perfect mitt for your feet and I got it off Amazon I'll have my Amazon storefront down below in the description but y'all this with that mitt bomb 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 so I discovered a new feminine wash well it's new to me it's the honeypot soothing wash so this one in my opinion is way better than the other one the one that comes in the pump this one is so soothing but yeah i got it online on target i don't know if they sell it in store they sell the ones with the pump in store but this particular one i haven't seen it in store so here's what the tube looks like really 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 good really soothing and i have been loving it let's talk about shaving products this one is a tree hut watermelon shave um moisturizing shave oil this is also a product that i shared with you guys when i did my target shop with me 
No, it was my hygiene shop with me. So we shopped in Target and we also shopped in Ulta. So check out that video if you missed it. But yeah, I've been wanting to try this out because I saw somebody, um, I saw a few people use it on TikTok and it's just been on my list to get for a while now. And I finally found it in Ulta and this is really, really, really good. So I've used this two ways. I've used it before wetting the skin and after wetting the skin. And I find that when I use it after wetting the skin is better. I don't know, maybe it's different for some of you, but I think, let me see. Yeah, it says apply to wet or dry skin. I don't know, I prefer my skin to be wet when I use it, but you know, you can use it however you want. But this literally smells like candy. It smells delicious. It works really well and I have no complaints with this. So I kind of want to smell, um, they have another scent that I still to this day cannot find in store, but I want to smell that one too and try it out. But yeah, this has definitely been working. Water just flew everywhere because I just took it out of the shower, but this has literally been everything and I absolutely love it. And then I have this one from Truly, which I have emptied. It's the Truly Cocoa Cloud Whipped Shave Butter. This is nice, really good. I've already repurchased it. Well, I purchased the, um, the Rich Shave Butter. This one is the Whipped but I haven't used the rich one yet, so I don't know the difference, but I will say I will be getting another one of these once I run out of the other one that I just purchased because it's really, really, really good. My only complaint with this is the jar is so small. Like once I got to the bottom, it was kind of hard for me to just get everything out with my hands. I know I can probably get something that will help me scrape it out, but I keep it in the shower and I just don't think about having something else like a little spatula in the shower with me but yeah that's my only complaint i know they have larger containers but those are like their body butters and stuff like that but this i really 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 enjoy and it smells incredible you guys it smells just like what it says it's vanilla coconut uh coconut milk argan oil white tea and it has a vitamin e in it so really really good hydrating on the skin y'all are gonna flip flip when I tell y'all about this one product that I've been loving more than my Olay body conditioner. Y'all are about to flip this. It's the Jergens wait, wait, Weightless Wet Skin Moisturizer. Y'all, 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 y'all. I don't think I'm gonna get any more of the Olay body conditioner. I know, I know you guys know that is my all time favorite product but um this is better this is way way better so this isn't used like the Olay body conditioner you guys know with the Olay body conditioner you put it on the skin while you're in the shower and then you rinse it off this one you put on the skin after getting out of the shower or even when you're in the shower just turn the water off rub it all over the body get out of the shower and then pat your skin dry with your towel girl this is like putting on a body oil. Okay, you're, mm, let me take that. Your skin isn't glowy like a body oil, but it feels like you put on a body, like, this is, my skin loves this more. It loves this way more than the body conditioner from Olay, so yeah. And I'm almost out, almost out. This is also a product that I shared with you guys when I did my Target shop with me, well, my hygiene shop with me. I love it y'all, I love it. I absolutely love, love, love this stuff. Now, speaking of the Olay body conditioner, I wanted to update you guys on the Nivea body shower, no in shower body lotion, cause I know I shared this with you guys as well. And y'all know I like to update you guys on products that I use. So this one is not as good as the Olay body conditioner. And you use this the same way as that. So you put this on the body and then rinse it off. And again, the Jergens, you just put this on without rinsing it off. You just put it on and then pat yourself dry with a towel. But this one is not as moisturizing as the Olay body conditioner, in my opinion. I've used this a few times. I wanted to use it enough so that way I can update you guys on my thoughts. And I am not obsessed with it. I don't even know, why did I put this in this video? Because I'm only talking about products I'm obsessed with. I still wanted to update y'all on this, so yeah. All right, so one of my favorite things to do when I get out of the shower is putting on a body serum. I don't do it all the time because sometimes I feel lazy and I don't want to put anything on. That's why I use stuff like this, like the weightless um, wet skin, skin 
moisturizer from Jergens. But when I want to do that extra step to have that extra moisture, extra hydration on the skin, I'll go in with a body serum and this one. Y'all, when I say do not get a TikTok, don't get a TikTok account, don't scroll TikTok because you will be buying everything, everything. But this one, I saw it on there. It's the Be Fresh from Dole to Dewey Hydrating Body Serum. Probably the best, best, best body serum I've tried that's affordable. Have I tried any affordable body serums? I don't think I have. So I take that back. The best affordable body serum. <laughs> I don't even, do they have, okay, y'all are gonna have to help me out. What are some of your favorite body serums that you can get from the drugstore? Leave them in the comments because I want to try them out. But I think I want to say this is the only body serum that I've tried that's affordable because all my other ones I get are like high end body serums. But anyway, yes, girl, this stuff. Let's talk about the scent first. This has a almondy. <laughs> be coming up with words girl but it smells kind of like I don't know almonds it doesn't smell like vanilla not to me it does let me, let me see let me see what's in it I don't know I don't know it just smells it smells so good <laughs> it has a sweet almond type scent to me with a little like maybe a hint a hint, a hint, a hint of cinnamon. Just a hint. Like you can barely smell it. That's just how I would describe it. I'm probably way off with that, but it smells so good. So I put this on the body first and then I go in with the body, um, a body butter or a body lotion. But this stuff will literally have your skin looking dewy. And that's exactly why they say from dull to dewy. Because your skin is definitely dewy when you use this so try it out if you can find it in target in store get it or just get it online i did see other products from the brand but i definitely wanted to try out the body serum first before i go in with other products um it says it has hyaluronic acid botanical complex ceramide and vitamin e which is really good for the skin okay let's talk about some oils and then we are almost done so fur oil if y'all have never tried uh, fur oil, try it. So this is what I've been using for almost a year now. And you don't need a lot. You just take a little bit of drop. Well, depending, depending on how you use it, I just use it after shaving. It's very soothing. It helps with ingrown hairs and it also helps with softening the hair too. So if you haven't shaved or, you know, whatever, um, it makes the hair feel softer and more comfortable if that makes sense. And I find that when it's time for me to shave and I don't feel like shaving, I use this and it just makes it more comfortable and soft down there, you know? Yeah. This next one is from Bio Oil and this is one that I recently started using and I also shared this in my hygiene shop with me video. So I like using this on the body but not all over the body. I only use it in the areas that I need. So my chest, my arms, my back. I have a few spots on my legs that, um, like a few areas on my legs that I use it too. So this is supposed to help improve um, dark spots. And I know that I like it. I will get a bigger bottle once I use this one up, but it's nice. It doesn't really have a strong scent, but there is a scent there, but it's not strong. And I don't know how to describe the scent, but it's really good. I've been loving it. And then the last product, well, no, I have another product after this, but this is the Secret Weightless, the Secret Weightless Dry Spray Deodorant. I like this. I didn't think I would love it, but I actually do. And I remember getting this in Target, which is also this um, one of the products that I shared in my hygiene shop with me before shop with me video but there was a lady that sprayed this on the aisle and i looked over i said girl what did you just spray it smells so good and she said this and i think i like it more so because of the scent it actually like it lasts on me and that's 
kind of rare when it comes down to deodorants, but this smells so good, so soft. It's not super sweet. It's, it's definitely like a floral scent. Uh, well, obviously it is, it's Wild Rose and it has argan oil in it. So it's been working for me. I like it um, and it does help with sweat too. So if you sweat a lot, if you have an odor, I would say try this, just spray it, you know, and you're good to go. So, okay, the last thing I wanna talk about with you guys is not um, like shower related, but it is smell good related. And it is the Bing Frenchy Soothe and Comfort Cashmere Vanilla Glow Perfume Oil. I'm telling y'all, this smells so good. So just like the body wash that I talked about earlier, this smells so good. So I put this on after putting on my body products, like my body oils, my body, all of that. This is the very last thing that I do. So I put a little bit of it. I actually have it on today. Um, I put some on my wrist already, but I'm gonna put it on again. So, oh, let me, let me show you the packaging first, girl. This is how she looks. Isn't it cute? How freaking cute is that? So you just twist it open and then this has like a little roller ball right there. So I just rub it on my wrist. <sighs> I cannot stop smelling this, it smells so good. Y'all, I'm getting hot. I literally just sat down after bathing and all that. So you can imagine how it feels in this bathroom, but <clears throat> it smells so good. So I rub it on my wrist. I also rub it right here i also rub it right here and then a little bit on the chest but i already overdid it earlier so i don't want to put too much on but this has been my go-to product straight out of the shower after i do my entire routine but yeah that is it girl that is all of my current favorite hygiene products hope you guys enjoyed this video and i want to know if I shared anything that you guys have tried, do you like it? Do you not like it? Or if you guys have any suggestions, any recommendations that you think I would like, leave it down below in the comments. Let's talk about it and all of that good stuff. But that is it, girl. Thank you so much for hanging out with me in the bathroom. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give me a huge thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed if you're not subscribed already. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.